Snipers are the subject of myths, legends and Hollywood melodrama. The best in the game are masters of stealth, concealment and precision shooting. But when it comes to taking an enemy down, the holy grail of sniping is the headshot. It's the most difficult shot to achieve, the smallest target, but when they hit it is the most effective way of neutralising the opponent. In airsoft they are impossible to ignore and if they are not seen coming can leave the enemy player dazed and confused as they walk back to their regen. Skullcracker. Revered by marksmen, feared by opponents. Headshots divide the airsoft community, and with the emergence of a woke airsoft justice warrior aggressively pushing their progressive morals and calling for them to be banned, they remain a controversial subject. And with so many great takedowns this year, it's been hard to narrow it down. But welcome to my top five most savage headshots of 2019. I'm gonna say this, and a lot of people are not gonna like it. If they see your head first, even if they aim for your chest, even if they aim for your waist, not necessarily being shot on purpose. Be aware, there's nothing Let's wrong with being Smithy. shot in the head. You can shoot me in the head, Smithy. Right, let's get things underway. In at number five, and taking place at one of my favorite fields in the UK, Reforger Airsoft. This one, I'm calling the stiff upper lip. Next up, and featuring three boomers in a row, this makes it in because it teaches an important lesson. Always take responsibility for your own protection and do not buy cheap Chinese masks off eBay. In at number four is the Goggle Smasher. Oof, the player was very lucky to get away with that one. Right, let's move on and a kill that was a close contender for top spot and featuring a special breed of airsofter who likes to wear face protection hanging around his neck and then complains about getting shot in the head. A headshot so savage that it caused this bearded gender neutral cheater to complain so much about it after I turned him into a thumbnail that the field banned me for sending my heavy balls into his chops. In at number three, is the beta male snowflake. I come here for a fucking shootout, right? A proper shootout with some proper men. Which, this lot of fucking nonsense to a man, they're fucking nonsense. Get out of your fucking way. Go on, get out. Go on, fuck off. Call yourself a fucking gangster. A shootout, right? It's a fucking shootout! Wankers. 
Oh dear. Um, in at number two now, and for the most of 2019, these were my number one headshots from a Milsim in Spain. This one occurred at the end of a long stalk as I ambushed a large enemy patrol. Shooting conditions were perfect, and the flight time and holdover of these shots puts the distance at around 90 to 95 meters. Not just one hit to the dome, but two in a row on two different targets. This one is called the Spanish Takedown. Having well and truly gotten the attention of the enemy team, at the very least delaying them from reaching their objective, I used the power of my new KMCS ghillie suit to slip away into the undergrowth. Uh, that brings us on to the top spot, and it's the winner not because of any long range accuracy. This kill was an accident that was never meant to happen, but this gets the top spot because of the player who took it. Taking not just one shot, but 200 to the face, this airsofter just laughed it off, shook my hand and got back in the game looking for revenge. In at number one, and dedicated to an awesome chap in Austria, this is the Airsoft Dude. Oh, f Mate, are you right? Oh, f Oh, <laughs> you okay? <laughs> wow, just incredible. And before I go, I'd just like to say thank you all for the time you spent watching my gameplays throughout 2019. I do appreciate all of you, and that includes the trolls and airsoft justice warriors who help send my videos viral. I've had an amazing time sharing my airsoft adventures across the world with you all. And that brings us to the end of the top five most savage headshots of 2019. Do you agree with the selection? Let me know in the comments below. Thanks very much for watching, and I'll see you next time.